saying you don't know what you've got until it's gone? Well, the truth is you knew what you had. You just never thought you'd lose it. In 2020, the sports world felt just that. The world put on pause as our nation battled through unprecedented times with no live sports for months to take our minds off the pain. Now, as we inch closer to normalcy, sports have safely been reintroduced back into our lives but not without its challenges. As we enter 2021, we look back at a 2020 that the sports world will never forget. The game tonight has been postponed. All the conferences listed on your screen canceled their tournaments. I've signed a proclamation closing K-12 schools. Just days after winning the Red River Athletic Conference basketball tournament and accepting an invite to the NAIA National Tournament, the pandemic ending LSU Shreveport season. The remainder of the Shreveport Mudbug season has been canceled. Eddie Bonine reinforced to the House Education Committee today the LHSAA would not cancel its sports season. The LHSAA will begin its COVID-19 altered football season the weekend of October 1st. Now that's one week earlier than the previously reported start date. And Brad, Louisiana has entered the chat. Yeah, that's right. West Louisiana finally getting things started this week. We've got big news out of the Southeastern Conference this afternoon with the announcement of a 10 game conference only schedule. Louisiana Tech set to begin their 2020 season. Excited about this week, about getting out there, getting to practice and getting to play the game. The pilots are carrying the nation's longest home winning streak into 2020. Their roster has also added some top tier talent. Area athletes signing to continue their careers at the collegiate level today. It was the best fit for me, you know what I'm saying? I'm very excited and nervous at the same time. It's not gloomy for the mud bugs on the ice. Shreveport off to their best start in team history. All eyes on East Texas today. Undefeated and defending state champs of Carthage taking on an impressive Gilmer team. Georgia Southern to build a 21-3 halftime lead before going on to win by the largest margin in the history of the New Orleans Bowl. The LHSA state championships relocated from New Orleans to Natchitoches. But I felt as though it was more imperative to ensure they were going to get a championship in in front of fans versus not. The Calvary Cavaliers walk away with the Division Four crown, their first state title since back-to-back -back wins in 2013 and 2014. The Manny Tigers, 13-0, are king of the mountain, champions of Class 2A. That's your look at sports.